What's going on, YouTube? It's Twig. And, buddy. We are back bringing another episode in the Dark Souls 2 Skull of the First Hidden walkthrough. And, as you can see, we're taking off uh, right where we left off. Um, what, what I want to do is talk to this lady right here. And, as you can tell, she gives us the handmaiden. Handmaid oh, my gosh, dude. I can't even freaking speak right now. This ladle, she gives you this little right here, the handmaid's ladle, and um, you get that, you get the ability to to uh, receive that after you kill those two trolls that we killed in the last episode, right where we fought the pursuer. Um, it's actually pretty cool. It doesn't do that much damage though. I think this is only the second character that I've actually got it on, just because I never knew to go back there. But I just thought I'd point that out before we head to Macduff to apply the raw stone to our rapier as well as upgrade it. So are you working on your way to Mytha right now? Yep. Alright, so you're going to be a little bit ahead, but um, that's okay. Wait a minute, let me see. Let me see real quick. Um, I don't think I have any fire. Mytha's weakness is fire. So, um, and I don't have any uh, pine resin, so we may be able to get one on the way there, though. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's let's just wait and see. And I don't have enough chunks to upgrade it anymore. That's okay because what I want to do is apply the raw stone to it. All right. Raw stone. All right. Sweet. Uh, that should upgrade our damage as well as it still enable us to apply different uh, resins to our weapon. <clears throat> okay, so those two things are out of the way. Now we're going to continue off where our last bonfire was right after Covetous Demon. And it's basically just a journey up to Mytha. And it can be challenging, it's not really if you take if you if you're careful. These guys can gang up on you and take some of your life, but uh, I think we should be alright. Now, I think I had a Estus Flask I could have upgraded before. Oh my gosh, I don't know why I rolled that way. And I'm just gonna take a couple hits by this guy before I finish him off. Okay, now, I don't know why I used a life gem right there but we have plenty of them to work with um what i want to do is basically well we're not we're you we decided on not doing uh pate's quest here right we can right. say we can save that for another time this guy does do a little bit of damage but uh i'll show you where you can go talk to pate we may come back and do it later in the game maybe not if we if we want his stuff we will but uh I like taking these guys out as fast as possible. Um, just because we don't we don't really have that much interest in getting paid stuff, and we're not going to be following up on any of the quest or not following up on very many of the quest lines, so it's not a real big concern to us. It is cool stuff, though. It definitely is cool stuff. I should put my poison moss on my heart bar just in case I'm in a fight when I get poisoned, but right now I'll just use flask since there's a bonfire literally right above us. Have you uh, made it to the second bonfire already? Uh, no, I'm doing the ladder. The ladder. Yeah, that guy put down the ladder for you for 2000 Huh? The guy put down the ladder for you for 2000 Oh, yeah. Alright, alright. Light this. Light a torch real quick. You get a Pharaoh's Lockstone and it's on me Titanite. Titanite. Really? That, yeah, well, I'll definitely need to do it then. If you light this, it should help out on the Mytha fight by... It takes away the poison around her... Uh, Yeah, I just 
second bonfire. I'm about to. I'm not gonna sit at it. That would suck. Don't die, don't die, don't die. I'm poisoned and I'm fighting just like I said that I kind of wanted to avoid. But, um. I hurried up and went through this door because I knew that once he closes it out, you have to go kind of like out of your way. So, what I did was basically followed that one guy into this room and kind of rushed the fight and killed him so I could basically just go back the way that I wanted to go instead of going around. Um, alright, so what did you say? You're just now at the bonfire? I'm going up the ladder. Right, up the uh, ladder, the trap ladder, I guess, where that dart shoots at them. Alright, yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, nice. Alright, now I'm just gonna run past everybody. I'm going to the hidden door. Alright, sweet. So, door. We will show you the uh, way to a hidden bonfire. Oh, uh, have you not gotten the hidden bonfire yet? No, I haven't gotten the hidden bonfire. Um, but this is the way you go to Pates, or one of the ways you can go to Pates, but. We won't be doing that in this episode, maybe later on in the game, like I said, but... Um, so, Buddy, what he was talking about, getting the ladder uh, to go down, you can come Shush. to this guy. How many souls did you yeah, need? It's gone. Can you remember? You Alright, to... sweet. Uh, you can do that. Oh, yeah. Have you know? I, I... This guy, if you pay him 2,000 right. souls, will set you down a ladder uh, go on ahead. so that you can... Get some loot down here. Bros locks on Twinkle Time Night. Not a bad thing for 2000. So let's head on back up. Um, now, McGill. What was his name? Lattersmith Gilligan? Uh, I didn't see what his name was. Yeah, what else did he. Can you buy stuff from here? Alright, sweet. Aromatic ooze. Um, that's for another quest later in the game. Uh, I kind of I like that outfit, but I don't really want to pay the money for it right now. So or the souls for it. So we're just gonna continue on. There's a trap right there that will shoot darts out. So we just avoid that. Head on up, and we're going to the hidden bonfire. guys can gang up on you. There's another one supposed to be right here. So there's another way you can go to Pates. I think there might be something good over there. But I can't remember. Um, not really, I can't really remember. Um, I, just got poison there. I may still get poison. It'll be alright though. There's a lady behind the head door. And I can't remember what is on this item. Spell quartz ring. Sweet. So yeah, that's pretty cool. We're almost up to the Hidden bonfire. Basically, we can run by all these guys. Have you got it already? Yep. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna literally run by these guys. And voila. One guy will, we will have to kill though. Even though we're poisoned, it's all good. <clears throat> Alright, so you're ready to go into the boss? Yep. Alrighty. Now, she can do a little bit of damage. Um, her weakness is fire. If you have a pine resin, I would use it. Do you have one? No, I do not. Um, yeah, if I had a pine resin, I, it might make it, I don't know how much easier, you know, how much more damage you do. that little hit there buddy but um, as long as that one I don't think that one's away from the door
Are you already in there? Yeah. All right, good luck. Thanks. <clears throat> Silverback spear, that's actually pretty cool. Dodge him and let's go in. Oh my gosh, he hit me as I was going in. Oh, you didn't get, get in? No. Yeah, I killed him. So, kind of, we just gotta dodge her first attack and kind of stay close to her. And just get in hits whenever we can. Because she likes to throw little cheap shots. But once you get her attacks down, you can pretty much dodge it. Ooh, that was quicker than what I thought it was gonna be. It's all good. Refill our health all the way. And get smacked by our tilt. Oh, if we could have got that third hit right there. That would have been sweet. Oh, no. Risky, risky, risky flask. It didn't go right away. We should be good, though. One more hit. Easy money. <clears throat> Once you get her attacks down, then, uh... She's pretty easy to predict. So, we make our way up to the Iron Keep. Did you kill her? Yeah, I'm heading there, but you will. Alright, very nice. <sighs> Iron Keep holds the worst invader NPCs, I think, in the game. Like, I almost for sure die here. Just because sometimes I well not not for sure but I'd say that oh my gosh they just I don't know one of them armor Dennis gives me trouble and then the other ones Fencer Sharon gives me some trouble sometimes but we have 30 almost 32k souls let's go ahead and spin them in this episode it doesn't feel, feel like this episode flew by I forgot to start the timer yeah I know me too I just was we well, forget every time I literally forget every time like. I don't. I don't know. I say I'm gonna start it, and then once we get our intro going and stuff, you know. <clears throat> All right. So I want to upgrade my flask, level up. We'll do that in this episode, and then we'll finish it off. However, um, I'm trying to think if there's anything. All right, sweet. I'm gonna hit that no man's war. Oh, to get that uh, shard. Or where are you heading to No Man's War? Uh, you gotta talk to the magic guy there. Oh. Get him to come to Majula. Um. Alrighty. Our build is looking good. Looking real good, as a matter of fact. Um, a couple more life gems. So, yes, 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 yes. Um, all right. While you're doing that, I'll go get the Estus shard flask then, or <laughs> Estus flask shard in uh, No Man's Wharf. Have you got the one in uh by the tutorial? Yeah, you did, you did, you did. Yep. We, we killed those trolls together in the last episode. <clears throat> you may want to get the shard here as well. In No Man's War, or on the way to No Man's Wharf. Huh? Yes. After I get this, then we can, uh... End off the episode. 
so you come through here, so you guys will uh, get out of the water, and basically, basically you just don't want to get hit by the gas that those basil basilisk things shoot out at you. They're pretty easy other than that. So many we got left? Just one? Yeah, one left and we're we can buy one off the hag. So that'll be we need at least one to get into uh we need at least one to get into um Shaded Woods. Alright, so there we go. I think there was a suit up here as well. Maybe I can actually get some armor that I want to put on. Might stuff. Let's see. Uh. Uh. I don't know. As of right now, I'm not seeing anything that I really like. I don't think there's anything left away, but we'll check it real quick. Alright, sweet. So, let me get back to the bonfire. Actually, let me just use a hobo bone. And that'll be... That should be it. Are you good with leaving it off here, E? Yes, sir. Alrighty then. We will see you guys in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out. Peace.